Hello, amazing leaders of tomorrow. Okay, so we are in a new year now, 2020. Let's hope for the best year yet to come. You always need to have this kind of positive uh, vibe and energy about the new year. Life as a pendulum. This is something I have just noticed maybe two, three years ago when uh, I analyzed my life and all those cycles I went through, good and bad, and I had a lot of bad issues. I currently have also many struggles with my new startup, but uh, I just noticed the cycles between the good and bad and how they are related, you know? Life is a constant change. Our cells are changing, everything is changing. You cannot just be still only when you are dead. So if you are not dead, it means that you are changing. But this change can be something like growth or a decrease. Like with health, like with your muscles. If you don't exercise your muscles, at some point they just get loose and they are not very attractive. But if you want to work on your muscles, they will grow and become bigger, stronger, depends what you want to achieve in your fitness. And so, if you take this in consideration and life as a pendulum, every time you will go like this. And if you are in a growing session, you will go like this. But what is this? What are these two sides? One are the struggles on one side and one are the rewards, let's say. Each reward will have a correspondent struggle. As high as the reward, or as big as the reward, as high as the struggle. You cannot have huge struggles if you won't gain a big reward. But many times people consider that, oh God, this struggle is just a bit too unbearable for me, too much, and so I will just give up. And many times they give up exactly in front of the closed door which opens the reward door, but they don't see it because they just stopped one meter away. And this happens so many times. As much as you start to notice your life, you will see that your, your struggles and occurrings are so related, like with every kind of bad habit or phobias, or if you want to just get loose or treat a fear or a limitation, a limiting belief, before that, you will face, like, the, for the last time, your shadow. And this happens so many times if you notice your life. Just need to be a good observant and you will see that everything is in cycles and things repeat themselves. So if you are more wise than you were 10 years before, I hope so, or five years before, you, you developed a different kind of skill sets. And so your struggles will be harder because you awarded yourself with a higher degree of understanding of things and now you can handle better this kind of struggles but if you go over them a bigger award is there where huge successful people find themselves at some point in their life and you will see common grounds with these successful people like they have that kind of inner peace they went so through so many things and at some point they just understand how things work and they had many big big struggles and they are very empathic with the people who are lower and they can understand that they need to go through hell sometimes to go so high that they are. If you want to grow, you will face a struggle. It's like a battle or a championship and you will face a, a challenge or a game. You need to win that game with the struggle to get your reward and your reward is a little bit higher than the struggle and so you overcome the struggle, bang, it comes the reward. Yes? Higher. So you have a bigger reward. You can feel joy, you can be, feel very happy, you learn some things, you became wiser. And so now, after some time, it comes a bigger struggle. Yes, a bigger one than before and even a bit over your head compared to the reward. And so you're saying, oh my God, the universe beat me again. I am so miserable, unlucky and so on. 
But no, this is your test. You want a bigger reward? You need to overcome this struggle. And so if you overcome it, then comes the bigger reward. And this is how you can grow in life. Same way, if you don't overcome this struggle, you will go down. You will start to go down. You will have small rewards, smaller rewards like a piece of air. Whew, now it's not so hard. I had such a hard week and now I have a couple of hours or a day when nothing wrong happens. It's like a small reward. But not doing anything to overcome it, you will just go down in life. It's like with the neurons, with like I said, the muscles, everything. If you don't practice, if you don't have habits to become better in some field, those skills you've learned, they will get lost. It's like with the memory. You don't practice memory, you will forget information. You will forget what you learned in school or university or in the workplace 10, 20 years before. So think about yourself like a creature of change. Everything about you is changing, but how you change, it depends on you. If you want to become bigger in something, expect those struggles and be like an athlete. Be excited. Oh God, if it's a big struggle, then I have a huge reward after. Let's just see what can I do. And you'll become like a detective or like a puzzle solver, a problem solver. And you can see life like this. And it's for everyone. It's not like some are more luckier than others. Yes, they are, but but I would consider those with the most struggles are the luckiest because they not only they get the chance to overcome more struggles than maybe others, but they become a better man, a better woman because of this. Going through struggles, if you don't go mad or insane, you will become a much wiser, empathetic, open, great leader for others because you went through so many situations and you can understand the bigger picture also and from your own experience not only from books or from others and this is such an important amazing asset to have so just think about this life as a pendulum and take your struggles like part of that pendulum push them overcome them learn from them and then you go on the other side where the reward your reward is and enjoy it enjoy it fully you can feel and live in the present moment now if you are consciously aware that these are moments in time and so take it like it lasts because you know a new struggle will come but that is also a challenge it's good it's something which makes you bigger stronger wiser and more worthier to live and lead others like a true leader if you have questions please just let uh, your comments below and i will answer to them you can find me through all my channels or podcasts <music>